Both the Rex Management's legal representative and the government's legal representative were back in court today as the resort sought leave for judicial review. Attorney at Lord Deacon Mitchell of the law firm Grant Joseph and Company, who represents the resort in the matter, spoke to the media following the conclusion of today's hearing. No, it lasts until the claim is determined by the court. And that claim is a judicial review claim brought by Rex to challenge the decision to acquire the property. So when that claim is determined, the injunction will be determined at that point in time. In other words, the court will make a decision whether the injunction should remain permanently in effect or whether or not the injunction should be discharged. Today's hearing is a continuation following the filing of an injunction against government's first gazette notice to proceed with acquisition of the Grenadian by Rex resort property. In response, the resort's management, MRI Limited, through its legal representative, filed an injunction against the government to stop the planned acquisition. This injunction is now being extended. This was brought before the court last week Friday and a decision given yesterday blocking government from proceeding with the acquisition. The Attorney General's office, represented by Solicitor General Dwight Hosford, in keeping with the judge's order, has refused to comment on the ruling. However, he told GBN that the issue will be given a full hearing on May the 24th. Additionally, he said that government will soon issue a press release on the matter. Cherian Blackman-Stephen, GBN News.